we are going to get a connection to the push button from the ground and connect it to one end of the push button and then another from pin number eight and connect it to the other end of the push button. We'll just choose yellow for now. So let's create that same circuit board in Arduino. So once again, we have our push button in the middle here. Now it's very, very important that your push button sits across this divide on your breadboard so that you have two legs on one side of the board and the other two legs on the other side of the board. The reason why this is important is because if they are, if it's connected on the same side of the board, you'll end up having a short circuit because this leg will be connected to the other leg and vice versa. All right, so we're going to test our push button to see how it's connected. So you get a multimeter, put it on the tone so you can test for connectivity. And when you do that, then you get that sound, right? That means 